Brandon Love Sports TV. I got a unique video I'm about to do. I just dropped my son off. We had a great conversation about the NBA and the quality of players. And uh, he and I brought, thought, of a, thought of a point. We're talking about James Wiseman and why he has not really measured up. A lot of people don't, don't know that my son, uh, one of his best friends, uh, his brother actually played against James Wiseman. James Wiseman is, is from Nashville. I'm from Murfreesboro, Tennessee. Nashville's like right up the road. Um, and so, you know, most of us knew about James Wiseman. We knew who he was. The thing about James Wiseman was that he was number one ranked in high school. But the thing about it is a lot of people don't realize that those high school rankings don't mean anything if you can't keep up in the workouts with the NBA players. Because once you get to college, you play that college, which is another level. Um, and that next level in, 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 in college, really that first year, that freshman year, it should be a, an indicator of what you're going to look like in the future, what a player is going to look like in the future. And if that player can't keep up with college players, what makes you think they're going to make it to the NBA? And one of the biggest points that, that my son made that really made me really brought, brought, enlighten me is that Shaquille O'Neal and, and, and uh, those guys of that era, you know, uh, Charles Barkley, Carl Malone, Patrick Ewing, Michael Jordan, those guys actually played three, four years. You know, they all played at least three, some of them four. I think Moses Malone was the first guy who came right out of high school, I believe. I can't remember if he came right out of high school or he played one year. I think he came right out of high school. But they, there was a there were few and far between were guys that were, that were coming right out of high school. And even today, you look at the guys, the better quality role players in the NBA, look, just look at their resume, look at their, their college. They usually went to school longer than one and done. So this whole one and done system, I know why it kind of got in place and how it got so far out of hand because they put those restrictions on kids not being able to come out of high school. And so what they did was they just made everybody say, okay, we're only going to play one year of high school until we go to the NBA. But it's killed the quality of players now. Because these guys are underdeveloped, they're not prepared for the next level. And that's just what's going on right now. But the, the reason back in the old days, while you had better quality players, was because they played in high school. They got the proper training that they needed. I mean, not high school, I mean college. They played more than one year of college, and they got the training under their belt. And when they got time to go to the NBA, they were prepared for that next level. Uh, so James Wiseman, is just, he's, I'm not just doing a video pick on him, but he's one example of so many players, that, and that's the reason why the NBA, in my opinion, is not the quality. Now, the stars are better than the old days, some of them. I mean, they're more athletic because they can train better. They're not, they're not as competitive as they once were, but they're probably more skilled than they were back then because of the, you know, the technology and being able to spend money on things of that nature. And, you know, they have more resources than the old school did, but... The quality of player overall was better in the days when the players were more seasoned veterans that had that college training that they built and sat under the the, um, the uh, Bobby Knights of the world, sat under the, the uh, in, in women's term. I always had to give homage, pay homage to Pat Summit. I'm not talking about women's basketball. But uh, people like uh, Bobby Knight and Coach K and you know, Coach Thompson, all those kind of guys. You know, those, those, you know, those were, those made the better players because they got the training under their, 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 uh, their, their belt. So that's just my two cents. Tell me what y'all think in the comment section. Brandon Love Sports TV. It's your boy. I am. If I get this camera straight, I'm out. Peace.